Hi, this is Sara. Welcome back to Hello Iran TV. In this video, you will find out can you buy a house in Iran as a foreigner and also how much money do you need for buying a house in Tehran. So join me. As you know, Tehran is the capital of Iran and the population is about 9 million. Also, it is ranked 29th in the world by its population of its metropolitan area. Also, Tehran is a big city and it has 22 different districts. Now, let's go to the first question. Some of you guys commented below my videos and you have asked, as a foreigner, can you buy a house in Iran? So I have decided to make this video and tell you. First of all, I should let you know, due to established law of Iran, as a foreigner, you can buy a house in Iran. But it should be noted, any foreigner can seize a limited amount of property in Iran. And also, I should let you know, for the foreigners, it is not possible to acquire arable land in Iran. So now I think you know, as a foreigner, you can buy a house in Iran. Now let's go to the second question. How much money do you need for buying a house in Tehran? Honestly, it's a hard question because as I have told you, Tehran is a big city. It has 22 different districts and in each district, you will find different uh, houses with different prices. So definitely it will be a bit hard and confusing to say how much money exactly do you need for buying a house. So I have decided to divide Tehran to three different parts. Then I will tell you the price of houses in each part. Now let's go to the first part. In the first part, I have included the northern uh, districts of Tehran, upper class areas and some famous and popular streets. Now, some of them are like Niavarana Street, Zafarania Street, Qaitaria Street, Velenjaka Street. In this part of Tehran, the price of the house is between 150 million tomans per square meter to 270 million tomans per square meter. Now you may ask, why is it this much different? I will tell you. We have some items that they are so important in the price of the house and it has direct effect on the price of each house. One of these items is the age of the apartment. The age of apartment in Iran is so important and definitely if you uh, want to have a new apartment, then the price of it will be so expensive in that area. And I can tell you some other items like facilities, such as elevator, parking, or even the materials that they have used for building that house, like the tiles, uh, wallpapers, or even the design of the kitchen, closets. These kind of things are really uh, important in the price of a house in Iran. And also you should consider this apartment. Is it located in a simple building or it is in a luxury tower? So these kind of things, they have effect on the price of apartment. Now let's go to the second part of Tehran. In the second part of Tehran, I have included uh, good districts of Tehran. Let's say like uh, Vanaka Street, Yusuf Abad Street or Sheikh Bahaya Street. These streets and the districts are good districts in Tehran and the price of apartment in these districts is between 60 million tomans per square meter to 150 million tomans per square meter. Again, that items, which was uh, the age, the facilities are important in the price of the apartment. Now let's go to the third part of Tehran. In the third part of Tehran, I have included some of the, um, let's say average and weak districts of Tehran, such as Engelov Street, Jomhuri Street, Fatemi Street or Savalan Street. In these streets of Tehran, the price of an apartment is between 30 million tomans per square meter to 60 million tomans per square meter. Again, that items that I have explained for you are important in the price of each house. Now, let me tell you something interesting. If you want to buy a house in center of one of the uh, popular cities in the world, let's say buying a house in the central London, 
you should pay a lot of money because the central London is one of the most expensive parts of the London. But in Iran, let's say in Tehran, it is completely different. I have explained for you the part three. The part three is mostly the central and southern districts of Tehran and it is mostly crowded and definitely they have good access to the city of Tehran. But you can see the price of the house is much cheaper in these areas in Tehran and it is completely different with some of the other big cities around the world. Maybe because of uh, our culture, people, they don't like to live in crowded areas. So now you know how much money do you need for buying a house in Tehran in June 2022. I'm telling you the date because the price of housing is increasing day by day in Iran, especially in Tehran. Some of the people, uh, especially young couples, they cannot afford buying house inside Tehran. They are moving around Tehran. So because of that, around Tehran, now we have some small cities such as Pardis, Karaj, and some other small cities. So they can buy house in those areas. The price of house in those small cities near Tehran is between 15 million tomans to 40 million tomans per square meter, which is more reasonable in comparison with prices of houses inside Tehran. And I should tell you these cities, these small cities are not much far from Tehran, maybe one hour or two hours driving to the central of Tehran, even in rush hours. Okay guys, so I have answered some of your questions. Now I want you to answer one of my questions. Do you think you can buy a house in Iran by using cryptocurrencies? Please comment below this video your answers and I will definitely check them. If they are not correct, I will make a video about this topic. Hope you have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.